Welcome guys, welcome back to another episode of GTA LS Video Power. Hope you guys enjoying the series so far. If you guys want to see more LS Video Power on the channel, feel free to drop a like, hit that subscribe. Don't forget to click on the bell icon to get notified when I release videos every Saturday is on the channel. I don't know why I forgot. What the hell is going on? Every Saturday is on the channel. Okay, apparently the AI glitched into the barrier. So <laughs> what the frick was going on there? Uh, anyway, today we'll be patrolling uh, Cyber Patrol again as the Cyber Patrol bike unit. This bike is part of the same vehicle pack that I have for the cruisers and stuff for Iron Patrol. Uh, as you know, the update for um, Department of Vehicle Slots adds two new motorbike slots, which allows you to have three separate uh, police bikes. One is set for Highway Patrol, one is the Sheriff Bike, and one is the normal police bike, which is default slot. Anyway, I still have a link down in the description if you guys would like to check out that uh, data file plugin. If you guys need any help installing the plugin, wait, but let me know. There's someone fleeing. Eh, well, let me know down in the um, description or you guys can DM me on Discord if you have any issues. Right. Let's go and patrol. Dispatch to Adam 5. Show me 1041. Copy that. Two, Adam, five. Proceed with patrol. Alright, so... I was actually thinking around with my computer for the past week. I did actually get... I don't know, my second graphs card was loose, so I finally got it to register it again so it should I should be able to what is it all the vehicle flipping probably because I have it as five times the vehicles whatever yes that black vehicle there right behind the truck is flagged for expired license oops This part show me in a traffic stop. I need one of the first set up one. This part show me ten eleven. Ten 
Let's just do it manually. Roger, Anna, 10, 11, in Grande Sonora Desert. Right, that's Doctor Suspect, expired license. Uh, let's see what we get here. Looking for the documents. Thank you. Uh, this license is. So his license is a 12th of the 4th. It is expired. License expired in months ago. Maybe in April. So yeah. I do have the um real time mod still installed, so it is going with the current dates. I just got a citation. Uh, I didn't get any suspicious order or anything from him. Uh, I get a play check to check the registration and stuff. Dispatch request in play check. Target vehicle license plate. 67 X-ray Union David 614 okay, so traffic no violation. Vehicle. Approach with caution. He's just flogging his expired license. So yeah. He can't drive, there's no one else in the vehicle to drive because it's similar. So we may have to just give him a citation, call a taxi for him and inbound the vehicle. Yeah, 79 days. Uh, so he's been stopped once before. He has no previous, um, no previous issues, citations or any history of anything. He's just going to get a citation. No. Uh, documents. Fair driver's license, more than 30 days. That's the only CC we see right now on this vehicle. Uh, he can't try, so we'll not let him drive. Let's just ask him to get out of the vehicle. He's coming up early. Alright, you're just gonna meet that off with a citation for driving without license. I already called a taxi for you. Your vehicle is gonna be towed. 
<laughs> You'd have to pay a fine to get back in Suiko. Dispatch to Adam 5. Two, Adam, five. Go ahead. Show me to go into the um, config files for the drama police that's the plugin that allows <coughs> to vocally talk to dispatch and edit some of this stuff response like uh, 1041 is on patrol not available for calls basically just the traffic stops and so then eight is available for calls. So I did not say ten forty one ten eight, so I should not be available for calls. But anyway, what the heck? I can always fix that. The rabbit crossing the road down there. I don't know radar. Rabbit crossing. Holy shit! Someone was speeding. I don't know if you guys saw that in the distance on the highway. <laughs> Just saw a car fly. Uh, black steel. That would be that vehicle up in front of me. Uh, suspended license. This one right here. Really, wh why are you pulling over on that side of the road, dude? Dude, make up your fucking mind. I know the traffic stop status never works for me because of my accent. Go ahead. Uh, let me cross back up. Two, Adam 5, roger that, on a 10, 11, in, uh, Tatapia Mountains. Roger, backup required, in Tatapia Mountains. Okay. I think it's some containment. I'll hold my target. Uh, I'll double back, stand by. Oh, negative, please. Do not fall back, I repeat, do not fall back. I'm within a mountain range. Highway, so... Hey! Back range of that shoes, by the way. Oh, I just asked for backups so I can, in case I need to scan any drugs. Driver seems nervous and sweating. Kiflam. I already know his, um, Thank you. Okay, so he is not the registered. Actually, he is, but 
Besides, it's just suspended, so that doesn't mean it's expired. to look there's taxis before. I'm nervous, so no obviously to exit the vehicle. We will pat down brighter lights and tell us all the stuff just because you seem nervous so you are kind of fishy. a revolver on him and an AP pistol. And his vehicle has a tin foil with half a gram of tan powder, which could possibly be heroin. I'm going to call it back up because, you know. You're under arrest, piece of shit. Don't arrest them. Some vehicle, look at it. Field test with me. Gun powder, so it's possibly heroin, so that's the first thing we're gonna test for. Is it a heroin, so it's gonna be a charge with possession of heroin. Half a gram. Check some weapons here. So the Navy revolver and the AR pistol. We're gonna check to see if they see so the serial number is not scratched off in the Navy revolver. It is registered in his name, okay. That's valid. The Navy revolver is registered in his name. Yeah, pistol. So he's going he's not gonna get charged for the revolver because that is registered in his name. We're gonna see if he has a gun permit. If he doesn't have a gun permit then he's gonna get charged for the revolver also. But right now he's gonna get charged for the heroin and the stolen pistol we found on him. That's the charges he's facing right now. Russian of heroin and uh, so his charges right now would be possession of heroin and also. There's no history. Does he have a gun permit? Does he? he doesn't have a gun permit, so he's also going to get charged for the 
navy pistol even though it's registered in his name that means he just bought the gun and it's registered to him but he doesn't have a permit for the gun so he's going to get charged for illegal possession of that firearm he's also going to get charged for possession of a stolen firearm which would be the ar the ap pistol and also the possession of heroin search. Yeah, charge for that. That will be the navy pistol. And also possession of a stolen firearm, the A. The AP um pistol and the navy revolver. I've suspended my sense. So the misdemeanor for driving with suspended license. There's uh what you call that out just they just ask my assistance required uh, in the mountain. The next station will be the Park Ranger station. I may edit the Park Ranger station be a, well they are technically a, a department. Uh, tow truck. Dispatch requesting tow truck. Mountains. We have a disturbance in Mirror Park. Units respond code three. I just wanted to call out quick here. Uh. Oh. Did not see the way that guy stopped there. That was annoying. Let's pass on the higher patrol unit. Whoop, see the easy. Whoa. Whoa. Crap. I don't have driving skills today. Mara Park is right up off the freeway. I'm taking the shoulder because it is the safest. Wait until I reach. Whoa, sheesh. Until I reach right here. I have to take this exit off. This part show me 1023. Roger, 1023. 10-4, copy that. Backup required on East Mirror Drive. Is backup required.
What do I mean, Safidi? Come on. Me up there? Yeah, it's set off, set off not this issue with the female beds. I don't know why. Let me just talk to the Really the guys right there Really <laughs> Oh well apparently it was the Lady inside What a call out Okay, so apparently, based on what I'm seeing here, is the the accuser of purchasing something which she clearly did not, and uh, right, yeah, but she clearly did not purchase anything when she told them she did not. Closed the door, went back inside, and the uh, threatened her and said they was gonna sue her something she didn't do so technically yeah yeah uh, i wasn't just respond no the forums word just no good high fi anymore <sighs> hold on i can't hear you go figure the traffic in the city is so Okay, she he admitted to being a scammer. Let's check the other one. He admitted it to it. This must be the driver. Okay, so he also admitted to it. So both of these guys are going to get arrested. Okay. I didn't mean to check the back of the vehicle, but yeah. <laughs> This is this game. Too close to the vehicle. Hold it! Right, so apparently this is the only way I can get them to go. Not 
Not legit, but yeah, as soon as I can arrest them right now. Um. Global boat, don't move. Fall back. Really? Don't make me use this. He's responding. I don't want to sit on the other one. On the ground. There, I said for fraud. And he's apparently intoxicated. I'm arresting also. you. Public intoxication fraud. And I'm not sure if he was a driver of the van, but he's gonna get charged for probably DUI if he was a driver because if it's this one was the driver, then this one. Okay, this one has neither mark, so they both seem to be under the influence of some drugs. Um. Consider yourself arrested. See you at the meeting circle. They both apparently are under some drugs and when they started falling in the background, so if you hear some white noise in the in my mic which I don't you hear. It's the rain in the background. I don't know why that rain decided to come from nowhere. Alright, so we're gonna carry these to off of the ladies premises uh back to the vehicles why is my bike on the ground really right. why are you running into a poor lady should be guarding that one and just Okay, him off of the lady's property. We would be searching the vehicle the uh, apparently came up in. I do a pat down on this one. So he has a pistol on him. And control substance. He is also intoxicated. Uh, let's get the. Hello. Yeah, should we be guarding the other one? Okay. Do a pat down. He has half a gram of bag of brown powder, which is possibly heroin. He also has needle marks. He has a gun permit for a concealed weapon. Didn't have any weapons on him. Let's search the vehicle quick here. Okay, nothing suspicious in the vehicle. We can call a uh, tow truck for it. Dispatch request in tow truck. Really, dispatch? Request in tow truck.
So we're gonna check the drugs we found on one of them had drugs on them, the other one didn't. As well heroin. So we're gonna check for that. Yeah. Positive heroin. So that would be the with that guy across the possession of her. Blend in! So let's just wrap up uh, and the weapon which we found on the other guy. The other number is intact. This registered to him. I don't think he has a gun permit. Clear the traffic here quick. Right, so this one would be uh let's see. Yeah, he is gonna get the, he has the gun permit, but he didn't have no guns on him. He had the drugs on him. This one does not have a gun permit, so he's gonna get charged for a illegal firearm. Uh, let's start with this one. Both are gonna get charged for public intoxication. Don't even have this. Uh, do drug. Let's just do it for the sake of it. I wasn't gonna do a drug swap on either of them. Uh, this one has a needle mark, so this one possibly needs a drug swap. You know, just to confirm my suspicions on this one, um, drug swap. Each probably gonna get uh, drug paraphernalia also. Because we did find needle marks and signs of intoxication. Met and marijuana. Oh. This one here is retinitis. Uh, this Thank you. Okay, he's over the limit, so he is publicly intoxicated. Alright. Let's press those charges. He is going to get charged with the possession of... Owen. And a uh, drug paraphernalia. Uh, 
So yeah. Oh, so he's gonna get charged with the Marauder. Um, hmm. Hmm. Yeah, I think I should charge him for general fraud. Charges. This case is going to get charged for the other one for public. You know. Technically, drug paraphernalia would pass with him. This one will be charged for um. Fences. Publicly intoxicated and also the fraud charge and if I am possession of possession of a firearm and fraud. Okay, so both of their charges are pressed. Uh, let's go for backup. Not for backup, for transport. Dispatch to Adam 5. To Adam 5. Go ahead. Request in transport. Roger that. Transport required. Assistance required on a uh, East Mirror Drive. Alright, so while transport is responding, we are going to uh, probably probably gonna go over the charges of today's cases Hello. and see what we have. Until these guys get um, picked up quickly. Alright, now that those guys are picked up, they head into jail -ish. Over the cases we did today.
So we can just reveal the outcome quick here. So um the guy that oh, he actually got not guilty. The this is the two scammers here, first one. Uh the possession public intoxication. He got a fine of thirty nine dollars granted probation for the possession of a illegal firearm. Two years in prison, a fine of $473. Uh, he actually got not guilty for fraud or oh, whatever. I may have charged him for the wrong thing there. This one's case. Oh, okay. He actually got defined for fraud. <laughs> this one, the three felony charges. Uh, drug paraphernalia, which was, we found a set of needle marks on him. Uh, and he also tested positive for meth. Okay, and had possession of heroin. He, for the drug paraphernalia, he got a fine of 700 and something, because I can't see it for some reason. Granted probation. Uh... For possession of heroin, a fine of $811, one year in prison. For f the fraud charge, he actually got guilty. Apparently, probably admitted to it. A uh, fine of 500 and... Uh, Fine of five hundred and sixteen dollars granted probation. Okay, so that's both of their charges and their stuff. Woody, that's the guy we arrested earlier on for the heroin and stuff on the highway. Uh, I may have pronounced his name wrong, by the way. Whatever. Uh, driving with a suspended license misdemeanor. Uh, fine of one hundred and thirty-eight dollars. Granted probation. Felony charge: possession of heroin. Fine of five hundred and seventeen dollars. Granted probation. What? Did I say that wrong? Whatever. You guys can see it on screen if I said it wrong. Uh, felony charge of the possession of the firearm, which is the Navy revolver, which was registered to his name. A fine of $505, three years in prison for the possession of a stolen firearm, which was the AP pistol, not registered in his name, and came back stolen. A fine of $450. Uh, two years in prison. Uh, this guy, I think we just gave him the um citation for the expired driver's license. He just got fined two hundred and thirty-three dollars for the expired driver's license, and that's all the charges and cases we did today. We have some cases from last episode. Uh. Yeah, I think that one was from the last episode. That's all. Yeah, most of it, that one was from the last episode. Uh, right. So. That's all the charges. Anyway, guys, hope you guys enjoyed the episode. Don't forget to drop a like and that subscribe. Don't forget to click on the bell icon to get notified when LSPFR is released every Saturdays. I'll see you guys in the next one. Ash Boss is out. Peace.